hello guys, Rob about one here. Um, sorry for loud noises, the road's kinda, road's kinda noisy right now. Um, <clears throat> uh, and today we're gonna be doing another walk along video because, you know, um, walking along. <laughs> I haven't done one of these in a while because I haven't really had anything to do on a walk video, but uh, this little walk video slash vlog is going to be about <clears throat> uh, is going to be about the new time rules and this is basically my opinion of them after using them for two weeks um, so currently right now I've had the ability to play with these time rules in uh, two different tournaments uh, no, no sorry three, three different tournaments I was at locals yesterday um, and in these free tournaments, I was able to play the game rather easily, rather quickly, and I was able to have fun with it. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, I was able to have fun with it in these free tournaments. The new time rules, they didn't really affect me, um, but playing them as a whole uh, and using them, like I have lost, I did lose a match to them um, at my local, uh, another locals yesterday that I went to. Um, I lost a match to them because, only because of the end of phase thing. Literally, if I had a bit more time, I would have beaten him. Uh, you know who you are. <laughs> uh, but literally, I feel like the new time rules are complete and utter bull, honestly. Um, even though they have their perks, even though they have their their boosts, their accomplishments, their, their benefits, um, even though they have all of that, they still lack the... They still lack the, the, the point of the game, which is something I want to I wanna get across. They, they, don't, they don't give us what we really want in the game, which is to have fun. Like, honestly, the, the few games that I've won with the new time rules as well, um, one being last week, uh, where I was playing against Paleo, we were having a grind game, I end up hitting his his uh his waking the dragon. He summons an ultimate falcon. Uh, with his ultimate falcon, uh, I uh, I am on because of the hit his ultimate falcon. He's able to hit me for about 1,900 damage. But that 1,900 damage meant nothing because he had a me starboy, and his me starboy essentially gave my Meliseeks, my Autogast Meliseek, extra 500. And because of that, I was able to get free out. <laughs> I was able to get three Meliseeks out, summon all of them, time was called, we were in battle phase, and I essentially did 3k damage, and even though he was in a winning position, even though he could uh, would most likely have won that match if it weren't for the time procedures, I won the match. And I, even though it's, it's a scummy way to win, even though it's not a way to win that I condone, uh, that I feel like isn't really fair for the game, I still feel like it's, it's a win. A win's a win, I'm not going to lie. Uh, I feel bad for winning that way, but, you know, it's a win. But even still, the, the, the win is still feels really dirty from what my perspective here is. And also, when you lose to these mechanics, as I said yesterday, I lost to, um, lost in time, because even though I'd been able to kill him, because all he had here was a scapegoat, um, <clears throat> I, could, it, I couldn't do anything. Literally, end of main, end of phase, please. What are you gonna do? But, you know, the new time procedures, these, they, they feel very dirty and very scummy. And I'm not, I'm not blaming anyone. Like, I feel like, like you could take your time, think about your plays. And I feel like that's still a thing where you have to do. But when it gets to those last 10, five minutes, you're gonna speed the hell up or I'm gonna start calling people. And um, seeing as these new time procedures are, do feel really scummy, really out of order, really ball, it's like, Playing with them, I've won two matches thanks to them, um, but I've also lost one. And the feeling of winning, it's not as good as it feels to actually win properly. Honestly, it, it doesn't feel nearly as good as it could feel if you won a game just normally, uh, just won it properly, just 
actually got your opponent's life points to zero. It feels a lot more, a lot more scummy. And I feel like because of that, it, it takes away from what the game is meant to be like. And honestly, when, when it comes to that, with stuff like that, it's, it, it's really not what the game is meant to be about, you know? It's, it's really not fun. It really does take away from the enjoyment of the game, from how you play the game. And it's, it, 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 it effectively means, oh, instead of getting my maximum amount of time to be able to play, I get bored out of it, and it's it, it feels really out of order, personally. And this is just my personal opinion of the fact that um, the new time rules, winning with them, it doesn't feel that good, but it's a win is a win. And losing to them, it actually makes you want to cut yourself, honestly. Um, the, the feeling of losing just because, oh, I'm about to win, but then end of phase comes along. It, it honestly makes you feel like, no, no, this isn't Yu-Gi-Oh. This is a, uh, this is something else. This is something else, and it, it's not fun to think that. It really isn't. It's not fun to have that kind of feeling in the game or have that kind of feeling in general. But when it comes to Yu-Gi-Oh, these are the new time procedures, and it really, really is just what we have to deal with now. And my personal opinion is, I feel like the time procedures are wrong. They should have never changed them. Like maybe instead of making it just to end a phase, give them one extra turn each. So finish the current turn, then get the opponent gets a turn to try and come back. But honestly, guys, it's it, it's a feeling that doesn't feel good if you win or you lose, because it's something that takes away from the game, and it feels like you're losing a part of yourself in it. And it makes you rush. It makes you worried. It makes you. It, it gives you all these sort of feelings that makes you feel like, okay, I'm gonna have to rush my ass off. Oh, I can't really think about all this stuff. Oh, I can't really do all this stuff. And it, it, it really does change the perspective of the game in time or when it's getting to those, that clock is just keep ticking down. Like, <clears throat> honestly, it, it's, it's not fun. It's not fun, the time, and it, when you're in those last five minutes, you're like, okay, we gotta go faster. We gotta go faster, hurry, 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 hurry. And it's, it's just not that good anymore guys and honestly looking at it from that perspective I feel like the new time procedures are complete and utter boom but guys that's the video um, what do you personally think of the new time procedures have from your experiences playing in them have you won some games have you lost some games have you enjoyed them do you hate them do you think it's good do you think it's bad um, tell me all of that in the comments section below because I love to hear your opinions, your thoughts, all of that. Um, also, if you like the video and want to see more walk-along videos where I just do discussions, talking about opinions, vlogs, uh, maybe what I'm going to do today, because like, today I'm going Brotherhood, uh, and I'm going to buy some, uh, I'm going to buy some product, uh, some some product to open on the channel, which I haven't done in a while, and hopefully pull the card, the one card I need. <laughs> um, but yeah, guys, that's the video. Uh, don't forget to like the video if you enjoyed it, comment as I said, um, subscribe if you want to see more Yu-Gi-Oh videos from me, uh, press the notification button if you want to be notified of those future Yu-Gi-Oh videos, and yeah guys, that's the video, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Robot1, signing out. Later guys.